St. Louis right now. We're gonna go over to uh, Gus's, which is which is uh, Gus's is a place where they pretty much wrap anything and everything in pretzel. Oh, the day I break these chains, I'm bound for the life of the simple things. So they even have dessert pretzels, and they have brats that they wrap in pretzel and uh, just everything and uh, it's a pretty famous place over here in St. Louis. I was introduced to it by some firefighters that I'd run into last time I was in St. Louis last year when I was in the van. So this year I'm taking Catalina over there. I'm hoping she'll get something to try and I'm gonna have some more gusses. Okay, baby. Well, we had like a less late breakfast, but I still want to try it. Yeah, and then after we're done here, we're going to head off to down by the Gateway Arch in the Mississippi River for a few before we head out of town. Just we're in such a hurry this time around because we got to go to Amazon. So, yeah, it is what it is. Speed into the work camping job. Yep. Yeah, but we are grateful, huh, baby? Yeah, definitely. I mean, uh, at least we got to see some country. I got to show you some stuff. And, you know, we didn't get to see as much as we'd like or spend as much time in any place that we wanted to. But, you know, we're building. We're building into this lifestyle. We're not there already, you know. It's one step at a time. We're getting to actually travel, and that's nice, but um, we're still tied to work a lot. Yeah. Well, that's the beginning. The day is beautiful again. We just stopped off here at Gus's and they're still open. Uh, it's called Gus's Pretzels. So this is the place I was talking about uh, the firefighters telling me about when I was here in St. Louis before. Fragrant and tender, I surrender. I am obsessed with you and totally obedient. Who came up with the magical ingredients? I you the devil's delicious handiwork. All right, so we got the bra and the uh, Italian sausage in the bagel here. I mean, in the pretzel dough, and then here we got uh, the two dessert pretzels. Are you ready? Let's go eat them before we go downtown. You want to cruise through there or not really? I meant drive by cruise. Alright. Alright guys, here's my bratwurst and pretzel. Tastes pretty good guys. Um, I think Catalina and I are going to go cruise through the neighborhood over here just for a couple minutes. Uh, I wanted to see some of the neat architecture. I think it's neat anyways. They're like turn of the century multicolored brownstone type buildings. Last year, I was able to go and park right up next to the Mississippi River, right near the arch. There was RV parking. This year, nope, it's all torn up. It's all under construction, so I'll just be able to drive by. Last year it was so much cooler. There's the arch. And this year, if you see right up next to the arch, it's all under construction. Uh, last year I was able to walk in there. There was a big park all in there and uh, Where you see that roadway that's all gravel That was a place you could actually drive and park RVs and then over there where that little dock thing is uh, There was helicopter rides from there. I was hoping to be able to do that this year, but nope Looks like there's a couple of new buildings here that I didn't see this glass one here. I don't remember it at all. Campbellsville. What's Campbellsville? Well, that's the Amazon 
Well guys, it's official. I'm back in the uh, south. Here's Waffle House. Hey there guys, I'm just trying to decide whether I'm just silly or something, but for some reason, I don't like having to go up to a cash register to pay for my bill. Uh, I always like just leaving the card and having the waitress come and get it or the waiter. Um, is that weird of me or kind of whiny of me? Because I guess it's not that big of a deal. It just just feels like better service if you don't have to go to a cash register. <laughs> what do you think? Yeah, I was expecting her to come and get the, the card, right? But then yeah. I think it's not kind. It's a good service. It's good service to yeah, have. Yeah, in my yeah. opinion. Yeah. Oh well, huh? Well, Catalina here decided for us to uh, go ahead and um, crash in uh, Coldington, Indiana because she didn't want to go all the way to Campbellsville last night. So do you think that ended up being a good idea or what? Yeah, it was. It was too cold. Huh? And then you, we had the opportunity to buy two heaters. <laughs> Weren't happy just with one heater, huh, babe? You got two for the RV. I want to have one in the wet bath on those really, really cold nights. Just a little heater to make sure that uh, we don't have the uh, waste tanks end up freezing up. We want you to get out there and connect with people. Live your big story. Make sure you do something every single day to reduce road sick. Peace, guys. Peace and love. And I tell you all about it when I see you again. We come a long way from where we began. Oh, I'll tell you all about it when I see you again. When I see you.